Welcome back. All right, so the next step is to try the different graphite pencils that I have for you. So I have containers that look like this. They're in the bottom of the eighth grade materials cabinet. Um, there should be one of each one of these pencils. What I noticed when I grabbed this one is there's some extras in there. Uh, if you have some extras, you can take them out and hand them to me and we can put them um, away. So in this container, there are all these different pencils. They have different names. Um, the shading sheet is also in the uh, materials cabinet for you to get. So there's 6H, 4H, 2H, HB, 2B, 3B, 4B, 5B, 6B, and Ebony. Okay, so they're different colors. It's just that they're different brands. There's nothing um, other than that. That's the only reason why they're different colors. So, and they say the names of the pencils right on the side. So like this one says 2B, that's your 2B. Your HB pencil is your number two pencil. If you look at the HB on the side, it says uh, HB right there. So this is kind of like your middle of the road pencil. It has a little bit of both graphites in it. So your Ebony, which is your softest, graphite pencil is going to be the darkest and what I want you to do is try these pencils so just read the directions at the top here you want to try the different pencils um, and try to sh fill these uh, spaces you don't have to fill it all the way but I do want you to try them um, the H pencils so 6H is your lightest ebony is your darkest so I'm going to use my HB here I'm going to slide these other ones out of the way and what you want to do is start to um, try and see what kind of range these pencils give you. So push down like with normal pressure, keeping your pencil lines close together, and then go really, really light pressure. See what kind of range you can get out of this pencil. And then like push down really hard, see what happens, okay? This is not shading or rendering, that's scribbling. We don't want to scribble, we want to render or shade. So rendering, or shading, you might hear me say those two words um, interchangeably, they kind of are a very similar. So shading is using short controlled pencil strokes to fill in an area and rendering is trying to make the um, object that you're shading in look 3D or look real. So you're trying to create some form with your shading, okay? So you're keeping the pencil lines close together. So I'm shading in between my scribbles here. Okay, so try each one of these different ones. When you get down here, um, these directions say draw a circle, try to shade it so it looks 3D. So you start with a sphere, and I want you to shade that so it looks 3D, but I'm not gonna tell you how to do it yet. All right, good luck.